Good evening, it's tragic. Doing our fifth, or my third video of the night. I wasn't going to do this yet, I was actually going to play some Apex Hunter and kill some time and then come back and do it later, but there's another up, down, up bait for Persona that I've got to wait to download. So I decided, eh, why not kill time and do this video? Um, I may do another one later. We will see. So from this point on in the game, other than me, me watching this game uh, through someone else's uh, no dialogue walkthrough, this is now going to be blind. Um, and that was a long time ago. So we'll be exploring this together. So this could get messy. Um, so today we're going to start with the last initial persona of a character that you can unlock. Uh, apparently the hardest character to unlock. There's a lot of things you got to do to get him. Um, you saw him. He was the guy that was in the room that was kind of rude to us and had his own persona. So we saw his persona. Uh, its name was Bress. Um, it's from the Celtic and Irish mythologies. Um, and he was a king of the Tuatha de Danann in Irish mythology. I believe that's like a, a territory or something. I didn't really look it up. Um, he was born to the Fomorian kin, and as a result, they favored him in his rulings. When Nuadha lost his hand and was considered unfit to rule, Bress was raised up in his place, with Brigid becoming his wife. His rule was harsh, making the Tuatha de Danann work as slaves and pay tribute to the Fomorian. He was overthrown in exile when Nuad Nuadha, I'm probably butchering that name, success, successfully replaced Pan. Uh, Bress would try to reclaim the throne with the help of Belor, but he failed. And Belor is... <clears throat> Belor of the Evil Eye, also known as Belor Belor, was the king of the Fomorians, a group of evil beings in Irish mythology. So that's all good to know. So we're going to continue through this game, um, hopefully they don't get lost, um, I'm, I'm, I may start putting a lot more time on this game so I can get through with it, because I don't know what other game I'm going to play, so without further ado, here we go. Why won't he tell us? All right, like always, we'll talk to everyone. Well, some of us keep good secrets. Um, for a long time, no one up here actually knew my name because I was known as DJ or Tragic. And... Um, actually, when I was doing music, or I was involved in the music world, um, what is this one? I wore a mask. So for a long time, people didn't even know what I looked like, other than my mask. And I remember working with an artist, um... really sure how to talk about that right there but um his ex-girlfriend i was telling her what needed to be done for a show and she looked at me and said who the hell are you and i was i was really confused because I, I you know i know who i am so i didn't really and she knew who i was but she had never seen me without a mask um uh, 
Um, so like I said, some of us keep our secrets pretty well. A lot of my people at work don't even know I record these or that I had a um, four or five year stint in uh, <laughs> underground hip hop uh, or that I'm even almost 40. <laughs> so it's crazy. That's like the weirdest looking dude I've ever seen. Like, he looks like a zombie. Takahisa Kandori. You're gonna catch me saying the names of these guys because I, li I like Japanese names. I like Asian names. Monkey suited gentleman. <laughs> and there we go with the monkey jokes again. Did the boy. Foul man. It's a bunch of teenagers, and we all know we're, I'm scared. To, I'm scared. Uh, I, was, uh, I dropped the line. Teenagers scared the living shit out of me. There we go. Savor yourself. Be a hero. I don't know how to feel because I kind of agree. Alright, so it's time to leave. Alright. Oh, we got one more room to talk to everyone in. Okay, so your first goal, they, you're supposed to go to Alaya Shrine, but you actually want to go to Yin and Yan first. Alright. So I completely forgot where I placed my notebook with all the ba bad guys we fought, so... Well, I know we haven't fought that one before, so hopefully we won't be getting a lot of repeats. Okay, so what do we got here? Cobold. And an Archangel. But I know we haven't fought an Archangel yet. Archangel. Archangel, Archangel. Same thing. Um, I got a feeling I'm not going to like him. So, 210 life. Uh... Neutral to element force and weak to physical. Um, weak to wind and blast. Okay. Get rid of these guys up front. Can't do anything Oh, 
this. Is, those guys were a lot weaker than I was expecting. So we're gonna do no damage to him at all. So now we just need to beat his ass, literally. Great, you're worth nothing. Sorry. Ah, he's not that hard. Ooh, good hit. He won't make it past this round. There we go. Alright, before I move again, let me go ahead and heal. <laughs> Also, let's start building my character. Okay, so Yin and Yan have some things you can buy. Um, mostly just weaponry. Like, oh, I did not want to do that. Hold on. Try this again. Sometimes the controls in this are terrible. That's terrible. Well, perfect then. That's not the way that works. Uh. Oh, she probably turned into a boss. Oh, different little girl. Okay. Still probably a boss. Little mine. <laughs> yeah, I can see that being weird. Alright, so. We should have plenty of money. Can you, can you look at. Here you go. So let's see what we got. How much money do we have? 378. How do I know if it's better? I don't like buying things if I'm not sure. Okay, so I'll buy one of this HP. Hydrojet, that's a cool name. Ooh. We'll buy the flashbangs for now, although I like the idea of the poison. I'm gonna buy those just in case. Alright, so let's see. Right, so let's see. We bought him an HP. Yeah, so that's definitely better. Bought you a HP. Okay, it's better. So far, so good. Okay, so that's cool. I 
That's why they're so cheap. So let's buy two more of these and one of these. All right, that should be for everyone there. So they equip them. Apparently you missed something there. All right, so everyone's good. And then unlike every RPG I've ever played, you sell what you don't need. And we're gonna go buy more stuff if we can. Right. All right. We're gonna make one more de detail or detour. We're gonna go to the Sun Ball, and we're gonna go to Rosa Candida. So it's not this one, but we'll save. So I'm hoping that uh, this video feels like it's going to be mostly me shopping. I may edit some of this out. just to read. Okay. We'll talk to everyone here. I'm going to read this again. My bad. Man. Right?
right, we're ready to go. I'm gonna sell a little bit more. So, um, I need the people watching this, that I know there's like three of you, um, let me know if I should edit out the shopping from now on and just show you what I'm equipping. friends just as you thought this world is a counterfeit of your own it is this world where Condori's ambitions lie if you pursue him you will eventually discover the nature of this world and how to return to your home world Condori has made his fortress on the east side of town where he is searching for something should it fall into his hands there will be no tomorrow for either world. You must stop Condory. The first step is to use the subway terminal to reach the east side of town. But the gate has a guardian. Look for the Expel Mirror. Well, up until a little while ago, you hadn't even heard of the um, the Diva machine either, right? It's a direction. Would that be like D spell? That? The guide that I have was wrong. Um, you use uh, oh, Mark's brag, I think it is. So it doesn't tell you exactly where to go here. It tells you to go to subway, but it's not that. Simple. You actually want to go to the historical society first. Uh, all right, we're back. That was ridiculous. I took two steps and was in a fight. That's what I get for passing up his heart in historical society.
So, like, the only real clue, I think, is that she talked about its exposure to the historical word, right? Otherwise, if you don't know to come here, this could take you a while to find. It's very... It doesn't really tell you. What she mean? So I'm going to go ahead and heal, because from what I'm reading, this next section is kind of... Oh, it's the next dungeon. You want to go to the subway entrance, can I get there? So I'm going to go into the subway. My goal is to get to a Actually, the bad guys here aren't difficult. Um, this place is amazing. Ah, new bad guy. So what do we got here? We have a siren, and I can't, I cannot pull their card yet. I don't think my character is the right level. Um, so let's see. We have siren. Two hundred thirty life. They're strong in nuclear blast, gravity, electric, and they're weak to fire, ice, and earth. And so they should. They're, so they're also will be kind of weak to magic here. So did it say it was weak to uh, strong to gravity? It did say it was strong. What poison? A weak to ice? Yes. No, I don't want to do that skill. Doesn't say anything about miracle, so we're hit with miracle. Hit it with fire, we definitely want to do that. And let's go with Mighty Wave. I'm hitting it with poison and fire to level those personas up. That wasn't so bad. I just walked in a circle. Holy crap. strong against physical and they're weak to element and force. So basically the same thing I just did in the last fight is what I want to do here. These things just have a lot more life. Uh, 
All right, got Slumpa. Help me. All right, they look like they look like shrimp. Like, right? Well, demonic shrimp. But yeah. Okay, that wasn't so bad. But I want all my characters to be level four. I'm already lost. In it. See, it's making me move. I'm not moving. It's making me move. Okay. check a couple things before we move forward because I think I'm going to just beat this boss um, no I wanted to look at skills so if I have if anyone has tetra tet, tetraja oh that would have made the fight easier I don't have, that's gonna suck. Do I have Tarunda? I don't have Tarunda either, shit. Oh well. Alright, so everyone's leveling up. 25. Where are you? 22, so I need him to level up twice at least. See if this is the right way. We'll know in a second. <laughs> Absorb wind and weak to fire, ice, and earth. Okay. Gotta hit him with poison. Um, oh, I can only hit one at a time, darn. They don't seem very strong. Persona. Oh, it actually worked. Wow. I felt like we did a good job with that. Let's just go ahead and wipe them. Alright, yeah, these bad guys ain't too bad. Try this way. It made me walk that way. <laughs> Got ambushed. Oh, it has all my characters looking the wrong way. I just realized that. Shit, my characters are poisoned. 
So let's see what we got here. Cat, a cave plug. Um, they're neutral to tech and rush. They're weak to whip and gun. So I'm gonna shoot them. And then a dark elf. Repels 50% of wind. Weak to electric, nuclear, gravity, and blast. So I'm gonna poison you. I'm going to cure you. Okay. Oh, I can't shoot them. Hit, hit. That might work. I hit her with blast. Alright, let's see how this works. Okay, I need you to like the well, whatever. One hundred and ninety three lives. One second. Nice. Okay, I need to finish this round. Well, that'll work. I hate any of the things that poison. You saw that it showed poison on one of the characters, but it didn't show it on all of them. I haven't figured out why it does that. Actually, I think this is where we're going to cut. It's been fun. Um, until next time. Oh, I got to turn it off. My bad. <laughs>